Hello, hello. Good evening, everybody. How are you? How was your weekend? Good evening, teacher. How are you? Great, Alexa. How are you? How was your weekend? Oh, it was very, very stressed, but... <laughs> but you are here, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and these days are the most busy, right? Yes. Yes, I understand because there are a lot of people in that places, right? Right. <laughs> It's because the season, right? <laughs> I know. Come on, guys. So yeah. you feel tired at the end of the day, right? Every day. <laughs> Every single day. <laughs> yes, you're right. And then when you come back to your home, you had to make the dinner, you had to make some cleaning, you had to take care of the baby, the kids that you have babies, right? And those kind of things. Be the yeah. It's como la, 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 la vida de padres, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Sí, es cierto. I promise. Yo también, también, Alexa. That's why I told you. And I continue. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. But we are here, right? <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello, Edwin Abarca, Edwin Flores. Carlita, Karen, how are you? ¿Cómo están? ¿Cómo me les fue el fin de semana, chicos y chicas? Excelente, excelente. Excelente, ok, perfecto, Edwin Flores. I'm glad to hear that, right? Qué sí. bueno que me lo fue excelente, Edwin. Me alegro mucho. How about you, Peter? How was your day and how was your weekend? How was your weekend, guys? Tell me. Ah, teacher, pensé que fuimos a la playa y todo eso. Ah, by the way, ¿cómo estuvo su viaje? How was your trip? Great, excellent, entertaining, amusing. So, so, a little bit boring, a little bit calm. How was your day, your your trip? Hello, let's see who is writing now. Write down. Yeah, I will be a listener at the meeting. Okay, perfect. No worries. Carla, excellent. Ah, excellent. Okay, do you enjoy a lot? Disfrutaron mucho, chicos. Se detuvieron, compartieron. Yes. Ok. Carla said yes. It was so entertaining, right? Qué bueno, me alegro. Marlene is also say yes. You were pretty happy there, right? Got an excellent teacher. Ok, perfect. I'm great to hear that because it's necessary that you take another environment from time to time you take a break, <clears throat> you take a trip like this because the work, sometimes it's stress, a stress and a stress and a stress you uh, and the stress at the end is not so good for your health. So you, you have to be distracted from time to time, okay? So that's great to hear that, that you get fun, you get fun, you were happy, you were sharing with your partners, you were enjoying about the place, right? And those, those kind of things, right? Okay, guys, so let me tell you guys that this, in this uh, section, we are going to see another topic that is called preposition of place. The last time we were talking about preposition of time, if, if you remember, right? 
I don't know if you if you watch the video, guys, from the last class. Do you watch it? Okay, Roberto is I will be a listener because I won't be home. Ah, oh, okay, you won't be at home. Tú no estarás en casa. Okay, perfect. So, the last class we were talking about preposition of time. And I remember that we were talking a little bit about that. And the last class, I tried to make a review about that in order you to get understand what was the topic in a better way? For example, we were talking about in, we were talking about at, and we were talking about on. The different uses of that prepositions and when we are going to use it, right? With which phrases we are going to use it. And we were making some practice online, right? In order to get a better understanding about the topic. But for this occasion, guys, we are going to talk about another topic that is related with prepositions, but it's another kind of preposition. For example, we have the preposition of place. Remember that in, at, and on is part of preposition of place also, but it depends on the context that you're talking about. That is we are that is why we are going to give another another meaning, right? But we're going to explain this more, more, more later, right? So, but first of all, I would like to pass the list, okay? Before I forget it, because I tend to forget it. <clears throat> just give me some minutes, okay? Uh, let me tell you that I am a little bit bad on my throat because I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I have a flu, right? Um, if there are some <laughs> the occasions that my voice was gone, right? So... Please forget for that, right? That's because I have a flu. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to pass the list first. Just give me some minutes. <laughs> okay, so let's start, guys. Alexa Guadalupe Flore, perdón, López de Viuda de Vázquez, yo estoy. I'm here, teacher. Ay, no, Alexa, te estoy poniendo otro apellido. Creo que me voy a limpiar los parabrisas ahorita. No lo veo. Ok, so, Berta Lisset Medrano Medrano. Daniel Jonás Hernández García. Edwin Asunción Abarca Celayandía. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Edwin Walter Flores Munguía. Present, teacher. Thank you. José Roberto Perla Guevara. Karen Beatriz Ramírez López. Present, teacher. Thank you, Karen. Carla Susana Flores de Ponce. Present. Thank you. Laura Guadalupe Bonilla Cruz. Present teacher. Thank you, Luis Enrique Varela Rodriguez. Mario Alexander González Celaya. Marlenis Noemí Martínez Reyes. Present teacher. Thank you, Marlenis. Pablo Josué Mansor Cruz. Pedro Ángel Benítez Andrade. Present teacher. Thank you. Pedro Mauricio Velázquez Sorto. Wilfredo Gómez Robles, Jenis Noemí Contreras Mendoza, y Yuri Vanessa Rivas de Tey. Presente. Ok, guys. Vaya, vamos a empezar. Como les dije la vez la, anteriormente, ¿verdad? Estuvimos hablando acerca de las preposition of time. Más que todo, eh, im se ocupó para generalidades como siglos, este, décadas, años, right? And also month, but without a specific date, okay? Do you remember that? Uh, teacher, mm -hmm. in para specific date. No, in oh. is more general. 
more general. Om is specific. Yes. Okay. It's not a specific. Yeah. Om is for more specific uh, for a specify the month and the date that you are going to do something, right? But at is for more specific things like hours, right? And the days of the week also, right? Digamos, el at lo vamos a ocupar con fechas en específico, bueno, con horas en específicas, ¿verdad? Y también con tiempos, por ejemplo, at noon, at night, at midnight, ¿verdad? Porque ya va intrínseco que hay una hora en la cual es medianoche, es el mediodía o es en la noche, ¿verdad? Entonces son, son horas, son cosas más específicas en las cuales vamos a ocupar este, eh, la preposición at. at. On lo vamos a ocupar con eh, días del año, right Fechas y meses en específico, cuando tenemos la fecha y el mes. ¿Ok? Pero si tenemos solo el mes, entonces no. ¿Ok? Sería in. ¿Es clear? Yeah. Ok, perfecto. Bye. Ok, so, after specifying this or explaining eh, this. Puede ser el año, bien, ¿verdad? Hola. El mes. O puede ser el año. Eso es in. Sí, así es. Es more general. More general. O centuries. O tal vez Chá. decades. Décadas. Y todo eso. ¿verdad? O hate. siglos. ¿Qué significa decades? Decades. Décadas. Décadas. Decades. Decades. Uh, how to describe... Uh, how do you write decades? In English. I saw in the chat. Decades. Okay. Thanks. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, so <clears throat> after this, guys, we are going to pass to another point that we are going to take today, right? So just give me some minutes and I'm going to share what we are going to see in this class, okay? After talking about preposition of time, we are going to talk about preposition of place, okay? This is another kind of preposition that is also used to say where is a place located or where is something located, right? Or place it. Today we are December, Tuesday, 11, 2023. And our objective for this class is that at the end of this class, students will be able to identify preposition of place. Okay, and our vocabulary word for today is this one, right? These are some prepositional plays that we're going to use today, right? We have between, we have after, before, behind, besides, next to, in front of, on, in, under, above, or against, okay? And here you have the meaning of each of them. If you want to take some notes, please let me know in order to let the screen there and you can write it down the meaning of that words that we have prepared for today. Yes. Okay. Any questions about the vocabulary <laughs> words? How do you pronounce against? Against. Against. Yes. Pero no against. Puedo comenzar. No, no significa eso. Again, eh, comenzar, lo confundo con eso. No. Begin es comenzar. Begin. No, Begin. Entonces, against eh, es en contra de o al contrario de. Depende del contexto que lo estemos utilizando, así lo vamos a ocupar. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí, okay. begin es, es comenzar, eh, pero ese es un verbo. Esa es una preposición. Ella le voy a decir cómo se escribe. Ay, se me pasó. Begin. Begin, 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 begin. Begin es comenzar y este es un verbo. Again. Okay. Yeah. 
Comenzar, <coughs> right? And okay. this is per, 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 vamos a poner por acá. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Excellent. Another question, guys? Let me know when you finish to take the notes, please. Hello, come. Uh, aquí la estos este vocabulary. Um, ya eh, entra en otra función, vaya. Sí. Ya no es on in de que estábamos hablando, sino que aquí ya es sobre de. Ajá, exactly. Remember that both they they fix in the both kind of preposition, but depends of the context. It is the meaning that you are going to give them. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Okay, perfect. Aquí, ¿qué vamos a hacer, teacher? En realidad no escuché bien la indicación. Oh, ahorita le, les dije que me avisaran si gustarían tomar ah. notas del vocabulario. Estamos tomando notas. Ah, okay, perfect. Ah, interesante. Very interesting. Okay, perfect. When you finish, please let me know. Okay. Perfect.
Okay, let's continue, guys. Okay, after defining the meaning of each of these vocabulary words, we're going to repeat it, okay? Let's repeat, everybody, after me, please. Between. 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 After. 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 Before. 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 Behind. 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 Besides. 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 Next to. Next, next to. to. Next to. Next, next to. In front of. In front of. In front of. In front of. Um. Oh. In. In. Under. 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 Above. 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 Against. 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 So we have begin, right? But this is a verb, okay? Just remember that. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. So let's talk about our topic for today's preposition of place. But first of all, what is a preposition of place? It says that a preposition of place, guys, is a preposition which is used to refer to a place where something or someone is located or is placed, right? As I told you before, it's to refer or said or describe where is a person located or where is a person or where is a place or where is a thing or what is an animal, right? So for example, where is Daniel's right now? Where is Daniel right now? Donde está Daniel ahorita? Daniel. Mm -hmm. Is in front park. For example. Uh huh. Daniel is in front of the park. Uh huh. Okay. Excellent. Example. For example, right? O nos, o tal vez podemos decir, Daniel is at home. Where is Daniel? Daniel is at, at home. home. Or maybe oh. you can say Daniel is on the chair, right? Mm. Está sobre la la silla, right? O está yeah. enfrente de la computadora. He is in front of the mm -hmm. computer, right? Sorry. Or maybe he is next to the the desk, we can say, or the bed, ¿verdad? Oh, está next. después de la cama, o está después del escritorio, etcétera, 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 ¿ok? Ok. Ok, let's talk about, or let's take some examples in which we're going to explain it, the meaning of each of them by watching a, a picture, right, about a dog. For example, we have on. Where is the dog? The dog is on the box. On the, the box. box. Yes. Yeah. Where is the dog here? The dog is in the box. In the box. Excellent. Where is the dog? Is over in the box. Exactly. The dog is over the box. Excellent. Over significa estar arriba, pero estar suspendido. Sobre. No tocando la superficie. Okay. Over. En el espacio. Yes. Okay. So let's see. Where is the dog here? In front of. In front, In front top. or? Top. No. Ah, uh, what is the left? No. The left? Oh, no, it's this one. ¿Puede ver esto, Peter? Ah, uh, permítame. Oh, under. Exactly. The dog is under? The dog is under the box. The box. Excellent. So, let's talk about this. Yeah. Where is the dog? The dog is in front of. Exactly. The dog is in front of what? The box, right? The box. Excellent. So, what is the dog here, guys? Oh, the dog is... 
behind behind box. the box the excellent box. where is the dog here ah the dog is between the dog the is bo between okay. between box and plural box the boxes right boxes the plural is boxes okay so let's talk about the last one guys where is the dog the dog is around the box the dog is around the box excellent so these are the places in which the dog could be right in this case we have another proposition here that you can take some notes about that for example around for example over how to use over how to use around okay so you can write it down that also right in order to have more vocabulary words any questions so far guys guys no okay let's continue guys after doing that we are going to pass to the next stage these are some examples okay these are some examples that we can take into account in order to use the prepositions of play for example we have the number one the dog is under the box Era lo que estábamos diciendo, ¿verdad? the dog is in front of the box the dog is behind the box the dog is on the box. The dog is in the box. The dog is over the box, right? And the computer is on the table. If we are talking about computer, also we can use on the table, right? Or maybe you can say, your cell phone is between the bottle of water and the coffee cup. Okay, my computer is beside the coffee cup. Computer is beside the cup. Okay, the coffee cup. Okay, coffee. what does besides mean? What does besides mean? ¿Qué significa besides? Detrás. Mm -hmm. Detrás. No, detrás es behind. No. Beside es a un lado. Right. Okay, se parecen. Uh -huh. That's Al lado right. De. Al lado yes. de. Uh -huh. A un lado de, right? Okay, la, perfect. O a la par de. A la par de, exactly. Vaya. ¿Alguna pregunta con estos chicos? Before pass to another stage. Tal vez. Un poquito como de pronunciación. Teacher, de nuevo. Solo para grabar un poquito el tono de voz en estas oraciones. Okay. Uh, do you want that I repeat the whole sentences or I repeat just the preposition? Okay. Okay, perfect. The dog is under the box. Under the box. Yes, yeah. under the box. The, box. the dog is in front of the box. The dog is, the in, dog front is, is exactly. in front of the box. Exactly. The dog is behind the box. The dog is on the box. Excellent. The dog is on the box. The dog is on the box. Excellent. The dog is in the box. The dog is in the box. Excellent. The dog is over the box. The dog is over the box. Excellent. The computer is on the table. Computer, the is, computer is on the, on the table. table. On the table. Okay. Your cell phone. Your cell phone. Is between, is between the border of water. Is between the border of water. And the, and the, the border of water. The border of water. And the coffee cup. Um, in the coffee Okay, my computer. My, my computer is besides. Is besides the coffee cup. The coffee the cup. Coffee cup. Okay, perfect. Excellent, guys. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. So let's see. 
Vaya, como ya terminamos, ahora voy a necesitar que ustedes me hagan un ejemplo, que me digan, todos tienen computadora. Everybody have computer? No. No? Yeah. Right now? Yeah. Cell phone? Yeah. Okay, what is your cell phone right now? What is your cell phone? Y me lo van a escribir en el chat de la meeting, okay? What is your cell phone? ¿Dónde está su celular? Please text me. Ah, in, in the chat. Mm -hmm. In the meeting chat. Escriba, Okay, let's see. Who is the first one? Let's see. It's a, uh -huh. Okay. Uh, Peter, okay. Peter, Peter, donde se se me corre el mensajito. My cell phone is in front of me, okay? In front of me. Check the spelling, please. My cell phone, creo que el, el corrector le hace y estragos, Peter. Okay, my cell phone is in front of me. Okay, perfect. Edwin, my cell phone is in front of me also, right? Peter, ah, okay, ya, ya lo, ya lo corregí, no me había fijado. Sorry, okay. Is my cell, Judy dice, my cell phone is on the table. No worries. Ma, uh, Carla, okay. My cell phone is on the table between the bottle of milk and my notebook, okay. Alexa, my cell phone is in my hands. Excellent. And my cell phone is on a book. Where is my cell phone? You said we, ah, but that's a question, okay. So you have to make a, a statement, a positive statement. Pedro Mauricio, my cell phone is on the table also, right? Wilfredo said, Marlenis, where is your cell phone also, right? My cell phone is, blah, blah, blah. My cell phone is above, okay? It's above, okay? Arriba, like, in the what? Pero ahí le falta un poco de la, la oración, okay? My, Wilfredo, the cell phone is in my hands, okay? Perfect. Karen, my cell phone is in front of me. Excellent, Karen. Also, my cell phone is in front of me. Somebody else?
This uh, Marlene is my cellular or my cell phone, right? My cell phone is on my bed, okay? Is on my bed. Está sobre mi cama, okay? Is on my bed. On my bed. Excellent. That's that's a way. Excellent. Thank you. Somebody else? No? Yes, no? Okay, perfect. So now we're going to pass to a practice online, guys. You are going to practice what are the preposition of place that you have gotten and you have understand. Marlene, say yes. Excellent. Okay, just give me some minutes and I'm going to send you the link, okay? Ok, vaya, esta la vamos a hacer todos juntos, ok, porque esta no, no se puede editar en línea. Luego les voy a mandar otra que sí se puede editar, pero esta la vamos a hacer entre todos, ok. Just give me some minutes. We are going to make it together. Ok, here we have this picture, right? Preposition of place. Look at the picture and then we are going to write. The questions to know or to use the preposition of place is where is that or where is tal cosa, right? So let's see. Look at the picture and then we are going to start to making questions <clears throat> like this, right? Where is the ball? Where is the ball here, guys? Where is the ball? It's under the table. Ajá, uh -huh. the ball is under the table. Muy bien, Carla, excellent. So, what we are going to do, guys, we are going to make questions like this, and then we are going to answer the questions según lo que vemos acá, ¿verdad? Vamos a agregarle la preposición para completar lo que dice la oración acá, ¿ok? Y va para eso vamos a ocupar estas preposiciones que ven en los cuadritos, ¿ok? In the box. Pero estas, chicos, no se puede editar en línea. Estas sí las van a tener que escribir, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, vamos a decir, ¿dónde está el pez? Where is the fish? The fish eats. It's. Where is the in, fish? It's in, in the fish bowl, ¿ok? Está dentro de la... De la pecera. Y así vamos a ir rellenando los espacios. We are going to complete the spaces in blank by making the question and by adding what is the preposition that belongs to each of my, these sentences by watching the, the picture that you have here. Okay? Okay. Always use the it. And... Yes. Ajá, uh -huh. sí, porque como estamos hablando... De animales y cosas, aquí no hay personas. Entonces, siempre me le van a poner it. Que significa iris. Está en tal cosa. ¿Ok? Ok. Perfect. Excelente. Si gustan, les mando el link para que lo vean cada uno de ustedes. Porque aquí casi no okay. se ve. Y lo hacen en su cuaderno porque no se puede editar. Esto sí no se puede editar, chicos. Vamos a ver, voy a abrir el WhatsApp. Porque no lo tengo abierto. Ya les mando. Pues, pues. Just give me some minutes. Que no me quiere cargar. I don't know.
just give me some minutes, guys. No me cago. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Si la mando a la meeting. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to send you in the meeting also, right? Because the WhatsApp group doesn't charge. Fast. Okay, the link is in the meeting. <clears throat> okay. Sorry, but I'm bad of my throat. Okay, let's give me some so I'm going to read send it. Okay, it's there, guys. It's in the WhatsApp group also, guys. Go ahead. Move this to King. We are going to move this to here. And you can start, guys. Who is writing? Let's see. I apologize. I do apologize because I don't have notebook and I'm driving. Okay, no worries. Later, you can send it. No worries. Teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello. Yeah. 
ese mueble amarillo Ah, ok. Ajá. eh, donde descansa la, el balón y el perrito Uh -huh. es la, eh, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Armchair. Armchair. ¿Dónde está este? Donde está la bola, el balón y el perrito. Todo es anaranjado. Uh -huh. Uh -uh. Ese es de armchair. Armchair es un sofá solo para una persona. Arm, armchair. Sí, correcto. Y lo anaranjado entonces es el piso o qué? Sí, this is the floor. Floor, ok. Yes.
Okay, Carla is already done. Congratulations, Carla. Thank you, teacher. You're, you're welcome. Okay, let's see who is already done also. Okay, done this, uh, who's it this? Wilfredo, okay, Wilfredo, excellent. No worries, Wilfredo, I know. Be careful because you are right driving, right? It's the besides the car drive work, it's amazing. Wilfredo, no worries, Wilfredo. Be careful, okay? You can do it after, when you are right home, okay? No worries. <laughs> okay, perfect. Hola, teacher. Yes, tell me. Hola. Hello. ¿Me escucha? Yo la escucho bien, bien suave. No, yo la escucho perfectamente, Pedro. No sé qué pasa aquí en mi iPhone. Maybe your audio is bad. Or maybe they eat in a connection.
Okay, Beatriz is already done also, right? Okay, guys, but you have to make the sentences, but you have to watch the picture. Según lo que vea en la fotografía, así va a decir a dónde está cada una de las cosas. Okay. For example, where is the dog? The dog is... Uh -huh. Where is the dog? Mm -hmm. Repeat where the is... question, please. Where is the dog? Ah. It's... Espera, me quedo. Yo me subí, ¿qué? Ah, what is the dog? Mm -hmm. It's on the floor. Mm, ajá, pero más referencia. Mm. Yes, you can say it's on the floor, but also you can say it's besides of the anchor or it's next to the anchor, right? You can say also, right? It could be possible, the three options. You don't think so? No sé qué pasa en mi, en mi iPhone, teacher. Casi no la escucho. Okay. Okay, let's see. Jonas dice, okay, Jonas is already done also, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect, excellent. So let's do it. Let's do it together. First of all, we're going to complete the sentences. Where is what? Where is the fish? Ah. The fish is in is in the fish bowl. Okay. Where is where is the table? The table is next to or besides, puede ser a la par o después, dependiendo de donde la veamos, ¿verdad? Pero creo que es next to, la más conveniente acá. So, let's see. Where is the cat? Where is the cat? Quiero ver dónde está. Ah, the cat. Is on the armchair. Is on, no, permítame. Is in front of the pillow. Sure. For me, the, where is the table? The table is, is um, beside. Besides, no, vaya, porque digamos, bueno, sí. Puede ser besides y puede ser next to, pero depende de donde lo veamos. Por ejemplo, si lo hacemos del lado de donde está el perrito para allá, es next to. Pero si lo vemos del lado de la mesa para allá, es besides. <risa> <risa> pero las dos son posibles. Ok. <risa> okay. <risa> 
where is the table? Okay, the table. Ah, no, vamos a utilizar porque el cine es muy largo, lo vamos a hacer. It could be next to, or could be beside that, besides, besides the armchair. Okay, let's continue. Where is, where is the cat? Ah, the cat. It's in front, in front of, in front of the pillow, right? Where, where is what? The dog. It's, ¿dónde está el perrito? Beside. Beside or next to? No, next to the old child. Next to, okay, next to the armchair, okay, the armchair. Where? Where is what? The pillow, where is the pillow? The pillow is? Almohada. In front uh -huh. of Behind is behind, muy bien. Is behind, behind the cat, okay, perfect. Where is what? Where is the magazine? ¿Dónde está la, la historieta? Uh, beside, beside. It's beside. Fish bowl. Besides the fish bowl, okay, excellent. Where is the armchair? It's between. Oops, Where is the armchair? The armchair. It's between. The table on the dock. Between. The table and the dog. The dog. Okay, perfect. So let's see. Vamos a ver. Vamos a subir un poquito. And the last one. The, where is the fish bowl? It's on the table. The fish bowl is on the table. Okay. So this is the way that you are going to work with this, okay? Where is blah, 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 blah. Where are, si es plural, where are, y si es singular, where is, okay? Is clear? Okay, perfect, vaya. Después de haber hecho esto, chicos, ahora vamos con la siguiente. Pero esta, la van a hacer ustedes solitos, okay? José Roberto is a where is, okay, Roberto, thank you so much. Just give me some minutes. Okay, Pedro Benitez also already sent it. Okay, guys, I'm going to send you the other link. Okay, but this is just for you guys. It's just to select, okay? No worries, this is a short process also. Okay, here we have prepositional place. We are going to look at the pictures and we are going to complete the sentences with the correct preposition. But in this case, you can manage this. You can choose what is the best option in the space in blank. For example, in, on, above, under, next to, in front of, opposite, op opposite right? Again, and between. Okay, so you're going to select what is the best by reading what it says. There is a small window. Hay una pequeña ventana. In, on, above, under, next to, in front of, opposite, against, or between the living room. What's the best option? Oh. In. Uh -huh. in right in the living room okay 
So in this way, you are going to work with that. You're going to select the best option that you consider fits there. Teacher, you can say the link in the mirror chat. Oh, okay, perfect. So I already sent it. It's in the WhatsApp group right now, and I'm going to send it to the mirror chat. No worries. Sure. Okay, is there? Go ahead. Thank you. You're welcome.
Guys, let me know when you finish. Guys, finish.
No, teacher. Finish okay. one picture. <laughs> ah, okay, perfect. Do you need more time? Okay, go ahead. Thanks. Just let me know when you finish, please.
Guys, if you need some help, I can help you guys. If you want, just make the two first readings and then we're going to pass to check it. Or do you want to make the three? Guys, let me know, guys. I will know, teacher. Okay, perfect. So, five minutes. Okay, perfect. Go ahead.
Okay, Carla is already done. Okay, let's check it, guys. Somebody else? Guys? Somebody else is already done? Carla is already done. Who else? Just Carla. Okay, two more and we are going to check it, okay? Okay, somebody else? Daniel already finished also? Carla already finished? 
No worries because of the grades, because this is the first time that you time that you make something like this. So this is not a problem, okay? This is something that happened in every process, okay? So let's try it. So no worries for that. So let's check it in. There is a small window in the living room, okay? As we were saying before. Uh-huh, what else? What is the second one? Mm -hmm. Under teacher. Okay. Under the window, are you sure? Next to, no, no, next to. Okay, you're, I will, let us be a cast, okay? Next to the window. The walls. No. Vaya, como vemos la, no, no, no. la, please, la, please. Figure, la picture aquí. Well. There is a small window in the living room. Under, under the window. Sure. ¿Le salió bien esa? Under. Under the window. Next to. Let me check. Under the window, the wall, in front of the wall. Vamos a ver, no está, ok, in front of the wall, en frente de la pared, ¿verdad? There is a yellow sofa. In front. Ajá. Uh -huh. Under, under a large row. Debajo está una... Una alfombra. Una alfombra. Grande, ajá. The Grande. sofa. In front, in front of, me salió malo a mí. This one. Yes. Mm. In front, let, let me check. On the opposite, entonces, on the opposite, or could be against. Al lado opuesto. On the opposite, or again, in contra de la pared, right? Puede ser también. Against, vamos a tratar con against. Against the wall, there is a yellow sofa under a large rope. The sofa is a lamp. Mm -hmm. Is next to Next to a lamp, ah uh, no, between, between a lamp and a plant. Entre la plant. lámpara y la maceta, la, plant. la planta, la right? Uh -huh. In front of, in front of. In front the of the sofa, the sofa there, is there is a, a coffee, coffee table. table, okay. There is a shelf. There is a shelf. What? What is the shelf? Above and arriba. Yeah. Okay, there is a shelf. Is it on a shelf? Shelf. Mm -hmm. There is a shelf. About the plant, and there are two pictures. There are um. two pictures. Um. Um. Uh huh. 
on the wall. Yes, there are two cushions. Where is that? Cushions, the sofa and the little dog. Cushions son como cojines. Cushion. Cushions. A un lado o between. Entre el perro y el sofá es. Mm. Yes, could be right. Depends. Um. It's on on. Um, right? Um cautions on the sofa and a little doe. Uh -huh. sitting at us on the sofa and a little doe is between between the cushions, right? Between them. <clears throat> the sofa. Where is the sofa? In front of the sofa. In front of. There is a TV, okay? There is a cat. In a blue basket, right? Because it is in the basket. In a blue basket. Uh-huh. Where is the, the, the cat? In... Pero aquí tenemos la palabra sofá. Sofá. Him. No, el, el gato está adentro de la, de la ah. canasta azul. Es in no, the basket. No, no, no. Pero ahí mm -hmm. dice que está... Next to. Next to. Ajá. Is next to... The sofa. Next to the sofa, right? Next to the sofa. Ajá. Ok. There is a small window... Okay, so ahora estamos en la segunda picture. There is a small window. In the study. In, in. study, okay. There is an office cabinet with a drawer. This is a draw, uh, office cabinet, right? With a drawer. Mm -hmm. Under. The Under. In front. In front of. In front of. Yes. Okay. Sure. Le salió bien. There is a printer. On the cabinet. On the cabinet, right? There is a revolving chair. In front of. In, in front. front of the desk. Uh -huh. There is a file cabinet. The desk. A file cabinet. Next to. Next to the desk. There are some uh, filers or archivos. Right? Where is that? Next to or... Against the wall. Contra la pared, right? Maybe. Uh -huh. Could be, right? Against yeah. the wall. Uh -huh, could be, right? The shell. Vamos a ver. What is the shell? This is a shell, right? And the and Where are the books? Under the shell. Under the shell, okay. There are, there is a lamp, the filers, right? Where are the filers? It's here. And the lamp is here. Where's the lamp? Between. It is? Between. Between, because we are taking into account the filers and the monitor. Where is the monitor? It's here, right? Filers are here and the monitor is here. So let's continue. There are a cat sleeping. Under. Um, uh, under. Under, under the desk, there is a cup of coffee. Where is the cup of coffee? On, on the keyboard, okay? On the keyboard or in front of the keyboard? In front of. Or next to the keyboard? Mm. 
Next to you. I guess it is next to you, right? Okay, there is a picture on the walk. There is a picture on the walk and about, about the monitor, right? About. Okay, perfect. So let's continue with the third one. Let's take a look at this other picture. There is a cat. Um. On the girl's bed, there is a shelf and a clock. A shelf and a clock. Above. Above the bed, muy bien. There is a desk, a wall mm -hmm. in the corner of the room. There is a desk. Mm -hmm. Against the, the wall in the corner of the room. The room. There is a pin board. Pink board. What is a pink board? Above. Above. Mm -hmm. Where's that? The desk. Between maybe. Uh-huh. This is the pin board, okay? Pin board. O como una pizarra para pin. Para poner oh. este... Uh, arregaditos, recordatorios con pines, right? Okay, where is the, the pin board? Uh, no. The desk and the chair. This is so this it could, could be... Tenemos dos, right? Between... Um, Bob. About the desk, or is next? Above. 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 Okay. Above. Yes. Right above. Arriba. Right. And the chair. And the chair. What is the chair? In front of. It. It's in front of it. of it, right? Okay. There is a little file cabinet um, next to or yes, right? Yes. Next to or against. Against. Against, right? Como el contrario de la ventana, right? Against the window. There is a football. <clears throat> next to. Next to. But well, there is not next to here. It's oh. behind. No, uh -huh. or under. Um. But there is a oh, football and a fish bowl. Hmm. There is a football. It's on. On? The fish. It's on. It's get fish? No, there is. But I'm okay. There is a football. Yeah, yes. it's a football, right? Between the mm. que de la silla y de la y de la pecera, verdad? Sí, pero es que pero es que no solo me... está tomando solo uno, verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces sería detrás de la silla o sería enfrente de la silla o sería sí sería de, de, de enfrente. Porque no está atrás. Right? Or the, al, 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 or the opposite. Sí, also que la, última, la última oración está hablando del gabinete. Mm -hmm. Que está de, este, contra la pared. Entonces lo que continúa habla sobre el gabinete siempre. Mm -hmm. Entonces sería between. No puede ser between. Mm -hmm. Porque no está mencionando otra cosa. Ajá, entonces sería. Uy. Um, 
Sería under. ¿Dónde está la, la pelota? Where is the ball? Is under. Maybe behind. But behind is atrás de la silla, but could be also, but right? It's behind of cabinet. Ah, okay. Oh. But this is another another sentence. <clears throat> okay, pero pongamos yeah. behind, right? Okay, perfect. And a fishbowl? On it. And a fishbowl on it, okay? Yes, you're right. There is a floor lamp. There is a floor lamp. Next to. Next to the window, okay? Next, the lamp and the chest of, let's get it. Is this one? This is the, between the lamp and the chest of drawers, there is a plant, okay? Between mm -hmm. the lamp and the chest of the drawer, I guess, oh, the drawer? Yes, no. Sí, puede ser. Could be between. The lamp. In the chest of the drawer, there is a plan. There is a rule. There is a rule. In front of the cabinet. In front of the cabinet. Near. Near. There is not in front. It's near, right? There is an open book. Where is the open book? In front or next to? Or behind? I guess it is behind. Right, porque si lo vemos desde aquí para allá, está detrás de la, del cesto de la basura. Yes or not? Guys, are you there? <laughs> okay, let's put it like this. The paper bin. Where's the paper bin? On the road. <laughs> yes, the row. Okay, let's check it. A ver si salimos bien. Let's check it. Okay, salió bien. Este salió mal. All right, the eight games. Estas todas no salieron buenas, chicos. Esta no salió malita. Okay, so just one. The little cabinet against the window, right? So it could be in front of the window. And here, also between them, in front of the sofa, uh -huh, there is a TV. So it could be next to the sofa or near the sofa, there is a TV. And also a yellow sofa, a large room. Could be, right, under. So it could be in front of, in here. Okay, perfect, guys. Excellent. So, what time is it, guys? Guys, nos pasamos, guys. Okay, guys. So, we, so we are going to stop here because of the time. I forget the time. And we are going to continue tomorrow, okay? Please try to make the homework from this week. And remember that this week also we have the final exam. If you want, you can start doing a part of the final exam and so on, right? In order to get the, the, the time with the homeworks. Remember that this is the last week and we have to finish with that, okay? It's clear? Okay? okay. Thank you. Thank you so much, everybody, and have a nice night, okay? See you tomorrow. See Thank you, you so much. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thank you so much. Good night, everybody. Good night, Peter. Good night. Good night, Peter. Good night. Good night.
Good night, good night, everybody. Ciao.